Hi guys, welcome to Audio Media Channel. This is Sello Kumar. Today we are going to be looking at a brand new video. This is essential accessories for your Panasonic SY camera. So when you buy the camera, you get this kit lens, which is a 20 to 60 mm f 3.5 to f 5.6 lens. It's a very, very high quality lens. Then if you look at the L series lenses offering from Panasonic and Sigma, there are a lot of lenses. In Panasonic, you have the zoom lenses and also prime lenses. Similarly, in Sigma also, you have these both. We'll do a separate video on those lenses. When you are buying this camera, it's a good idea for you to buy the Sigma MC21 mount converter. This mount converter will allow you to use your existing Canon glasses with this camera. So now I have mounted my Canon 24-70 f2.8 lens using this adapter. So I can just connect this to the SY camera and I can start using it. If you look at the performance of this mount, it is really very good for still photography. Autofocus works perfectly. But when it comes to video, it does not support continuous autofocus. That's a downside. Next important accessory is XLR adapter. This XLR adapter, the model number is DMW XLR1. You have two high quality XLR inputs for your Panasonic SY. It also supplies phantom power from the internal battery. So you don't need any external power requirements for using this XLR adapter. And on top, that's also a hard shoe. So you could even use a professional shotgun microphone on top of this unit and get a very, very high quality audio input inside the camera. The panel here has two volume controls. It also accepts line level signals. Say, suppose we are using an external mixer. We could take the outputs of the mixer and connect it to this unit. So that way, your audio solution will be really paka with this unit. The next accessory is a flash trigger. This is the Godox XT2 trigger, which is compatible with Olympus and Panasonic. That is the model you will have to ask for. A Olympus slash Panasonic model of trigger is what will work with the Panasonic SY. Using this trigger, any Godox flashes, be it the 860 Mark II flashes or the V1 flashes of any brand, that is Godox flashes that works with Canon, with Nikon, with any camera will work with the Panasonic SY provided you have this trigger on top of the camera. Once you put this trigger on, then you can use all the battery flashes. You can also use the Godox Pro flashes like the, the AD200 Pro, AD300 Pro, AD400 Pro, AD600 and all even the new AD1200 Pro. The next accessory you're going to look at is the batteries. This is the battery that gets supplied along with the Panasonic SY. It's quite good. It lasts for around three hours, but Sometimes that is not enough. For a professional, it's always better to have two batteries. So during a shoot, if one battery gets drained off, you can put one battery on charge and you can use the next battery. So that's really essential. With two batteries, we can easily run a day. Uh, additionally, if you also have a battery pack, you can use this battery pack to charge your S5 through the USB-C cable. That's a very, very good option. This option was not available for the Panasonic GH5 and other cameras. And in terms of the memory cards, the SY has two slots. So the first slot can take high-speed cards like the V60 and V90 cards. And the second slot can take a V30 card only. Even two V30 cards are going to be more than enough for this camera. Guys, Hope this video was very informative for you. To see more videos like this, please subscribe our channel. Like this video, share it with your friends. If you have any doubts in this video, you can leave it in the comments and I will 
reply as soon as possible. Like this video, share it with your friends. This is Selva Kumar signing out for Audio Media Channel. Thank you.